I'm Maddie, and here are our top 10 nighttime animals. Tarsiers may look like gremlins, but these guys don't need to look pretty under cover of darkness. Each eye is as big as their brain to let in as much light as possible, and they have excellent hearing to catch nocturnal insects. Tawny owls have also got big eyes for excellent day and nighttime vision. They have very light sensitive cells in their retina called rod cells and about 56,000 per square millimetre. These effectively light up the night allowing them to hunt in near perfect darkness. Bats are winged masters of the night. Contrary to popular belief, their eyesight is actually okay, pretty similar to ours, but at night they use sonar or echolocation to get around. They make sweeping high-pitched noises and listen for the echoes to form a picture of the darkness around them. Blind cave fish spend all their life in the dark, even during the day. That's because they live in pitch black caves. Having eyes isn't much use to them, so rather than wasting energy to build and maintain them, they've lost their eyes completely. Eye eyes are the largest nocturnal primate in the world. The food it's after isn't visible anyway, as it lives under the wood of trees, so the night is as good a time as any. Combining an enormous finger with gargantuan ears, it knocks and scrapes on wood to listen out for any tunnels and grubs beneath. Spiders are, for some, the stuff of nightmares, and that is when they do most of their creeping and crawling. Big sticky webs become invisible in the darkness, and eight eyes keep a close watch. Trap door spiders even hide in the dark, ready to leap on anything they feel overhead. Lions might look impressive during the day, but a lot of the action happens at night. These big cats have a reflective layer at the back of their eye called a tapetum lucidum, which bounces any light back past the light-sensing cells to give them double the chance of seeing their prey. Snakes might be a surprising addition to nocturnal activity, with only small eyes and internal ears, but some snakes have amazing heat-sensing pits, which lets them track down warm-blooded prey in perfect darkness. The red-eyed tree frog has enormous eyes to allow it to hunt down prey at night. Its incredibly bright colours means that any would-be predators may be dazzled and in the confusion, the frog can hop away. The pangolin is one of the night's weirdest creatures. What they lack in eyesight, they make up for with a great sense of smell to track down small insects like termites and ants. If you don't want to be kept in the dark about more amazing wildlife facts, then make sure to subscribe to Earth Unplugged, and we will see you soon. And all he's doing now is I've just shown him some of the heat from my hand, so he's picked those up with his heat sensing pits at the front. It's not as um, as defensive as everyone thinks, so the animal doesn't need to be stressed out. He's just letting you know that he's around. Do it without exerting any energy at all. When we grab hold of something, our arm muscles contract which pulls tendons in our fingers and causes the hand to close. To keep it closed, we need to keep contracting our muscles. 